I started my morning with some green juice. I made this last night and it's so good and easy. And then I was starving, so I had two pieces of focaccia. I get this at Trader Joe's. Then I had breakfast and I enjoyed my time with my dogs before starting to get ready. I always shower before working out, like a body shower. And I freaking love my shower, y'all. And also today's video is sponsored by Cuddle Plushie. They offer really great quality bath products. So I'll definitely be sure to talk about them in a bit. But this is me getting ready for my workout in my Cuddle Plushie towel. And then I just grab my workout set. I'm going to spin today. And here is my outfit. I'll link that down below as well if y'all are interested. But it's one of my favorite outfits to spin in. I also switched my shoes to spin shoes and I made my bed. My fiance wasn't home by the way. And then instead of coffee, I had pre-workout. I'll link this down below as well. And that just gives me a ton of energy in the mornings to actually work out. And here's me getting ready to go into the studio. I go to Wright River Oaks. It's my favorite workout, my favorite place. I cannot recommend spin enough and they are being super safe with the pandemic. Highly recommend back from spin it was a great class i burned 466 calories and i took caroline and i go to ride at river oaks not to shower which it's much needed i am so red and sweaty and like i said earlier today's video is sponsored by cuddle plushie they have quickly become one of my favorite companies they sell good quality cotton products for your bath and home here i just have the softest towel i've ever owned their cotton is organic and can chemical free and their stuff just feels super luxe but it doesn't have like a luxury markup so I am truly obsessed with these towels they are probably the softest like at home towels I've ever had like they feel like hotel and spa quality which it's just amazing just look at it like there's nothing better than like a soft towel you know what I mean so they have like towel sets they have a ton of things and they also have this which is one of my favorite ways to dry my hair I'll show you guys in a second it is a hair wrap towel so because their cotton is organic and so well made their items dry quicker than just regular towels and this is just so good for drying your hair without damaging it they also have robes i love them and everything comes really really nice and well packaged so if you want to give something for christmas they have super quick shipping i think it's like three to five days and everything comes like wrapped perfectly so this would make a great gift i'm definitely getting my mom a robe but first i'm gonna shower and then i'll tell you guys a little bit more about cuddle plushie i know i must look so cute right now but basically I just use this hair wrap towel from Petal Plushie um, to dry my hair. So I've been trying not to do any heat on it, like blow dry it or anything like that, just so it gets like a little bit healthier since I do have like curly color treated hair. Y'all, I noticed that by using that hair wrap towel from Petal Plushie, my hair just dries so much quicker because I guess it's organic cotton and it just it's so much more effective and not as damaging for my hair so it has a ton of benefits and i saved the best thing for last this robe is truly life-changing i literally feel like i'm at a spa or like a five-star hotel after i get out of the shower and i've always been the kind of person to chill in my like towel after i get out of the shower in bed for like hours so now i can actually do things with my robe it just feels so darn nice it fits me perfectly i'll have everything linked down below i'll show you it has pockets it's just beautiful so here is a better look at the robe i love that it has pockets i can actually like do things around the house while wearing it and it just feels so soft so nice i didn't even know like the benefits of organic cotton like they're antibacterial and environmentally friendly and so many things and you can get it like at home without paying like a ton of money for them so i am obsessed with this so highly recommend cuddle plushie they have so many bath products you won't regret trying them out everything will be in the description box below thank you to them for sponsoring today's video and let's get started with the day all right so i showed you all this bathroom a while ago and how i have all my makeup here until the desk from ikea gets back in stock 
and I just received the best product I can think of in the mail. So as you can see, I have this right here, and then this right here, then this, another one right here, and then another one right here. Obviously I bought these separately, and they don't really stack up nicely, as you can see right here. So let me go get the product, and I'll show you. Look at this. So it comes all together, it is, I think, about $30. This is not sponsored, it's from Amazon. And I love that it's just one. It's tall, but it's still pretty compact. So I'm gonna change all of my makeup into this thing and show you the finished result. And yes, I am still wearing my robe. I am speechless. This is a freaking game changer. Almost everything fit, except for the lip stuff, which I have to declutter because I don't use half of those. But I'm shook. I'm literally shook. I'll link this down below. Like I said, not sponsored, but oh my God, I am obsessed. I finally got the package that I've been waiting for from Crate and Barrel in the mail. So I've never ordered a napkin from there because I always thought it was super expensive, but they had my dream wine glasses. So if you've ever watched Scandal, these are supposed to be like the wine glasses from Olivia Pope. I know this is so ridiculous, but like I'm so excited. This is 25, getting excited about wine glasses. So I got four of these and let me just say, I don't really care what these are for. Like I don't care about the type of wine you're supposed to drink them with. I just really love the size and the long stems. I think they're gorgeous. So I'm so excited. That's everything I got. I got two of these cause these were like $13 and then I got four of these and if we like left them and use them a ton i might like complete the set hey guys quick update i've been doing a bunch of things the past few days so i wanted to like give you a rundown of everything and then i'm gonna do a good like unboxing and just like a haul of things that i got in the mail and things that we like purchased so yesterday was exciting because we went to walmart and we rented out one of those vacuums that have water in them. I don't know, they're like carpet cleaners and to buy they're like $500, but to rent they're only, I think 35 plus the tools. It ended up being like 46 for the day. And there was like this big stain on my like walk-in closet. There was like a smell coming out of the ottoman that was left in this house. And just with three dogs, us shedding hair and just the dirt of moving, I really wanted to do a deep cleaning of the carpet upstairs. So that is what we did yesterday. So I'm going to show you all that. It was so crazy and so satisfying. So let me show you. Okay, so here is a famous stain that grosses me the heck out. Also, I mean... This carpet is not ideal, but we are dealing with it for the time being. Probably next year we will like actually start replacing it. But for now, this will do. So this is bolt, no, bolt. This is it. So we rented it for like $35, I believe. Bolt. And you can get their brand of like cleaner but instead we got this one that was much much cheaper and i'm so excited so i'm going to the whole upstairs area and show you guys befores and afters okay i've only done my closet so far i'm already so tired but look y'all it completely came out i don't know if it was pee or what but the water is literally yellow so it's gonna be gross when i show that so i'm just warning y'all now but this is really cool. I literally looked it up on Amazon to see how much it was. 500 freaking dollars. So it's definitely worth renting it at least for one or two days. The next update is that we completely rearranged my office and we have a very exciting addition to the house. So let me show you the office and you will see exactly what I'm talking about. So yesterday with a carpet cleaner, I actually went ahead and clean this and this was at my parents house for like a year and a half so there was a lot of cat hair on that <laughs> and now it looks brand new um i decided that during like thanksgiving break i will be spray painting the legs black so the gold will be officially gone and then i'm going to wait for a black friday sale like fingers crossed to get my like replace this chair 
and I just decided to leave the dogs staying there because they always like chill with me there. I don't know if I ever ended up showing y'all this cabinet, but I spray painted the handles and I painted it and I think it looks pretty cute. I do have like some random stuff, stuff, wow, stuff on top of it um, that will probably like not stay there. I'm just trying to like see what works and then just a random trash can that I needed there. Here is the exciting thing i finally got a diy like peloton um for very affordable so i will do probably like a whole video on it or like a more in death like vlog but i love it i'm so excited i'm gonna subscribe to the peloton app and i also got this from amazon is an ipad what is it called like tripod holder thing mount um, I just put it right there for now, but I'm so excited. It comes with like the clips and I'll have everything linked down below. For now, I just have it in the like old yoga mat because I haven't purchased like a full one from Amazon. I don't think I will. I might just like flip it because I don't like how you can almost see the words. Um, and then I just have the couch here. I tried to clean it yesterday with that same machine. It didn't go too well. I don't know if you can see the difference, but yeah so for now i mean i know i say this all the time we are putting up the curtains don't worry but yeah that's what the office update is i think it will look much better once the legs are painted and once this is actually in the garage but for now i'm just gonna put it here i think it's just gonna be much easier for me to actually use it on that note i have a few things to do so i actually have a clip from halloween from this past weekend today's actually election day so the stress is high um obviously i voted i think my voting sticker is somewhere around here i voted early here it is um i hope you all voted by the time this video goes up we'll we'll know who won so very stressed out about that anyway i'm gonna show you the halloween clip and then i'm going to probably later today give you all a little like unboxing i also ordered all the christmas stuff that will be in the next vlog so get super excited but yeah let's let me show you our halloween costumes and then we'll chat later it is halloween we are full on ready if you recognize these costumes they are full on for my fashion nova video and look at my cousin's makeup. I did it myself. Yeah, Hold she on. actually did it herself. Yeah, I punched, punched her, her three times. And look how cute she looks. Full, thank you, Fashion Nova, for the costumes, literally. <laughs> and I am 100% not wearing these pigtails because I look like I'm 12. But I hope you all had, well, had, because this is going up way after, but I hope you all had a safe Halloween. We had so many trick-or-treaters. It was so cute. Here is our <laughs> leftover candy. Um... But yeah, I will catch up with you all tomorrow. I've truly become the worst vlogger. Not that I ever was a good one, but it is days later. Once again, got a little busy. The elections were happening, by the way, no comment. Um, we still don't know the results, by the way. It's like two days later. Anyway, I wanted to show you a few updates, a few things that we got in the mail and hopefully get this vlog into a better spot than it is because it's a messy one. But anyway, let me show you for some living room updates. Or living room, no, dining room. We tried to find a rug yesterday at Home Goods. We had no luck. And we apparently didn't measure the table correctly, but for now this will do. So I have this little table runner. It's really pretty neutral, kind of like linen-like, and I really like it. For now, we just have those placemats there. I don't know if we're gonna replace this, so that's why I don't know if we're gonna keep those placemats either. But I did change out the pompas over here for this like eucalyptus mix, and I think it looks really cute. We also switched out the bar card for the wine um, thing, and I think, honestly, I haven't really consulted this with my fiance, but I think we're gonna get rid of that, at least like put it somewhere else or give it to someone because it doesn't really go with the space and I'll put on the screen what I want to buy on Black Friday if it goes on sale. It is like a buffet, I think, and I think it will look really good right here. It's like the exact same set as the table. It is very expensive though, but I really want it. And I just think the wine fridge just doesn't look good. I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. 
Um, we don't really use it. And then I have this. This is the curtains. I don't really want to show you my street, but we ended up getting blackout curtains from Amazon. I have to steam them, but they are such nice quality. Like, truly shocked that these are from Amazon. And it is a really pretty, like, whitish gray color. So I got the same ones for my office. I wanted to show you a few things that I got in the mail. A lot of it is from Amazon. So let me show you. I decided to try the famous crazy, crazy yoga or CRC. I don't know. Um, to see if they were actually, like, my Lulus. Well, my fake Lulus. And they're not. I'm not super, like obsessed with them yet i am going to try and wear them to spin tomorrow and see if i like them they're not bad but they were like 25 dollars, so i just want to know if it's worth the hype then i got a few things from esr they sent me this um what is it called one of those like glass protectors for your phone and i got some stockings oh my god y'all i'm so excited i'm decorating for christmas later today and that vlog will be up probably on tuesday um but they are very neutral they came in a five pack plus a little like doggy stocking for like 30 dollars. great deal they're they feel like linen and they have really pretty like neutral patterns and colors they're all different very cute very excited and then i'm going to diy my ottoman the navy one that they left in the house so i got i'm so extra i got one of these like fabric staplers and later we're gonna go to hobby lobby oh maybe i'll do that in today's vlog we're gonna go to hobby lobby to get the fabric so i can actually staple it and then if you hear some noise my lovely lovely fiance is cleaning our bathroom goals I cannot stop buying jewelry on Amazon. I saw Rachel Radke talk about earrings that look like these. They're like chains, chain links or something. But I don't know. I thought they were going to be a little bit daintier, a little bit smaller to me. They're like a little chunky. They're, they don't look bad. I just don't know if they're like actually my style. They were like about $15 from Amazon and these definitely retail for way more in other websites. Let me know what you think because honestly, I don't know if I'm going to keep them. Like even looking at myself like this, like I don't know. More stuff from ESR. They send me a wireless charger. This is supposed to be like a really quick one. So I put it in my office. Then they also send me a fitness belt. I really want to get into running. Let's see how that works. But I never know where to put anything. So they have this in different colors. I just went with the black. They have like a spot for your keys, your headphones, everything. And I think I got the size small. I'm not really sure. But I will keep you updated on how that goes. This is exciting. I got this package from Manta Sleep. I'm actually doing a few videos with them. And I love silk um, sleeping masks. And they have this one that is so cool because it doesn't like dig into your eyes, especially if you have lash extensions. This is a freaking game changer. I've been using mine and I freaking love it. How silly do I look? And it's just so good. This is not sponsored, but I'm so excited to have this now. And then I got a huge package from Fashion Nova. Everything that I got from Fashion Nova is here in my room. I guess I'll show you some of my favorites and then you'll have to wait until the video goes live, but Look at how cute this like cardigan is and it's so soft. I think this is like Chanel, Chanel, I don't know. And then I got a workout set that is really pretty. It's like this leopard like embossing. I don't even think that's the right word. I don't know, but I got the top and the bottom. What else can I show you? Oh, I got these at TJ Maxx yesterday or at Marshalls. Do I need more workout clothes? Yes, <laughs> I don't know why. But I got these, to be honest. I'm not obsessed with them. I tried them on when I got home and I don't love that the band is so thick and that it kind of rides down. And this is a small, which is very shocking. Um, so I wouldn't be able to spin in these and I don't really love when bands just write down like generally. Um, I also got a beautiful set. Um, it's just like a lounge set, the red cropped hoodie and the sweatpants. I've been wearing that a ton. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for the video. Oh, I also got this from Free People and Marshalls. It's just a really oversized, like, crop top. This is actually a small. 
how i don't know where does free people get their sizing is the question but it retailed for 38 dollars and i paid 9.99 great deal i was gonna show you the bed but instead i'm gonna show you my precious dad thank you for cleaning the bathroom cutie he can't You're even welcome. hear me Oh, you can hear me? Let me show you the bedroom. So, I am really going for an ivory, beigey, neutral, kind of like the bed frame. So, I think the pillow looks cute. I definitely think I need to switch out the other pillows. Like, I don't know. I don't love them. But, I think it looks good for now. Like I said, I love our curtains. I heard you all loud and clear about this. And I'm dealing with it. We're taking pictures, I think, on Friday for like christmas like our christmas cards that no one will get <laughs> and i will print them out slightly bigger than these still do three and then put them right there and then i'll probably move those downstairs and then this is a little bit messy but you can see i kind of like switched out a bunch of stuff switched out the pompas um i have some those here perfumes right here because they are stunning not sponsored and then yeah i just brought the mirror here i think this mirror looks so much better here than it ever did in the office and the lighting here is just much better so and i also brought the vase with the pompas there just randomly please ignore but what do y'all think what else do i need to do to this room because i don't know okay lastly like haul wise I got a very exciting package. So I've been getting some very random emails, like email offers to send to me from Amazon. And I always say like, no, what the heck is that? But someone offered to send me a freaking king size bed canopy bed frame. And I was like, heck yeah. So I'll put on the picture what it looks like because I don't think I'm gonna do this on this vlog, but I'm gonna do a whole like guest bedroom transformation. I'm so excited. Right now my cousin is there. That's why I don't wanna do it like today. She leaves on Monday, I wanna say, so I'll do it then. And I really do have an exciting update that no one will care about because I haven't mentioned this on my channel. Oh wait, let me finish my train of thought. I am all over the place. Anyway, it got here. So I won't do that in this vlog, but stay tuned because I will do a whole like guest bedroom transformation. Right now it's very pink, very random. Is he okay? Good job, Skibby. Anyway, like I said, right now the bedroom is really random. There's a lot of like random pink stuff, things that I used to own. Um, and I want to make it a little more neutral, more grown up, like for when my brother comes stay or something. Right now it just looks like a teenager's room, if that makes sense. So I think with this, it will look really awesome. I will catch up with y'all later. Um, if you're still here because oh my god, I'm all over the place. This vlog is all over the place and that's just me.